Hey, once again, it's your boy Dede for Triple D Gaming coming at you with another how to video. You know how we do it. Let's get to it. All right, guys. So, this is going to be a real quick uh, tutorial, show you how to change the image on a billboard uh, slash sign um, or how to add your own to it. So, first thing you're going to do, um, sorry about that, hit the mic. Uh, first thing you're going to do is you're going to take the image. Or your logo or whatever it is that you have uh, that you want to put on the billboard uh, slash sign so you're going to grab a hold of it and whether it be a mod a map or whatever so if the billboard is inside of a map that you're trying to change it on um, you would go into you would open up the map and then you would find the textures uh, folder if it doesn't have a textures folder um, you can make your own or um, just find out where like the pictures and that are located within the mod and then you can slap it in there you could actually just put it right in the main folder of the mod um, but wherever you put it you have to leave it if you move it later it will mess it up so uh, first thing you're going to do is um, you'll grab whatever it is you're and you're going to put it in the texture so um, let's see we got a picture of some fish in a McDonald's uh, board there will act like we just put that in there okay all right so then um after you get that in there and let's say you have these uh somewhere else on your computer um and you get into where you're going all right so only thing you're going to do is you're going to find you're going to click on it and if that doesn't work you'll just um tap up here until you actually get the picture highlighted of whatever it is all right so now we got that highlighted so uh control z goes back um so now that we have that highlighted all we have to do guys real simple come down here to the uh albedo map i guess that's how you pronounce that all right and then you'll hit your three dots up here okay now it'll open this up this is where it's critical very critical guys um, you have to make sure that you go right to where that mod was and go right to where that textures folder was that you just put that picture into if you don't pull it from here uh, while you're in the editor it'll look like it's working but as soon as you throw it in game it, it will not work okay so um, we'll take the picture of the fish double click on it hit the X boom puts the fish on there uh, let's say we didn't want the fish on there. We wanted the McDonald's sign on there. So same thing We'll hit the McDonald's sign um, Now if this is a PNG and you just threw it in there, let me do that again You come in here If it's a PNG All right first time using it uh, As soon as you click on it right there It'll say it's not the right file and then it'll ask you if you want to convert it. Yes or no you hit yes and it'll convert it to a DDS file then all you do is hit exit boom and it, pu it puts it in there now if you can't find where the actual picture is um, up here you'll you 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 might end up having to click on everything because sometimes just clicking on it itself doesn't work you have to come up here and click on everything until you see it highlight now if it doesn't highlight there's still a way to do it and I'll show you that now all right so what you're going to want to do is you'll come up here to create up at the top click on create primitives click on plane um, so now when you click on plane you don't see it it's like where'd it go so you got to scroll clean to the bottom it'll put it right here on the bottom uh, so now you click on that then you can come up here to names and name it whatever you want so uh, logo for bill board and then that's it then it'll change the name of it right here all right so same thing click on these three dots right here underneath your uh, material editing materials the albedo map click on the three dots click on these three dots up here and then uh again we'll go to um our mcdonald's sign open 
exit. All right, so now where's that? It's underneath the map. So we'll hit Control B on our keyboard and just click up here. So put it up there. This was by request is why I'm making this video was by request because I have a similar video. So I just went ahead and made another one. Then you just got to sit here and mess with it guys until you get it to where um, it's sitting flat on there. And I'm not going to make sure it's perfect because I want to make sure this video is nice and quick. <laughs> Alright, so you'll get it to where it's sitting somewhat flat-ish. Something like that. Uh, let's do 71. Point eight. We'll act like that's good enough. Uh, all right, and then um, you would come to scale. It would be the scale X. All right, so then. You'll delete all the numbers and you'll just keep raising that number until it gets big enough to cover that billboard. Seven is not big enough. Eight. Eight might do it. And normally the width of your plane, it's going to be the scale X and then scale Z would be the height of it. So if we change scale Z that will be the height of it Boom. and then you get it sitting up there flat okay <coughs> excuse me <coughs> now you got to find the billboard itself right here billboard um, which is this whole thing right here all right so then you'll click the the scroll button on your mouse and you'll grab a hold of that billboard and you you kind of got to do two hands <laughs> and just while you got the button pushed in on it, you got to roll that scroller all the way up to uh, your billboard and then drop it in there. So now whenever you grab a hold of this billboard, the picture and everything will move with it as long as I put it in the right place. Uh, where'd it go? Oh. So we gotta drop it up here in the main the main thing of it. So now if I can click on it. Uh hang on. Of course, I don't want to move, right? Oh, it's because I didn't even have it up there. I was like, wait a minute, that should be working. <laughs> All right, so, boom. Now it's in there. So now, see how it moves with it. All right, um, so that's that. Now, if you have something that's curved, the plane thing isn't going to work. So you're going to have to find um, like this here is curved, this sign here. This has a curb to it. So what you're going to do is you're going to ha you have to find the curb, uh, the what's in there already or it's not going to work. Um, so we found the picture that was there already. Okay. So same thing, come down to the albedo mapping or whatever you want to call it there. Click on the fish, hit open, hit exit. Now, now we got fish on that sign. Okay. It's that simple guys. Uh, I can't make it any easier, <laughs> but that's it for this one. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see what's coming, what's next, hit that subscribe button and I'm out. Doses.